Hello all. The goal here is to recenter my tailstock to the headstock after having offset it to cut a tapered thread. Now, there's a million ways to recenter the tailstock, but uh, I find that using a coaxial indicator is the quickest and easiest, as uh, you'll soon see. So, first thing I did was to recenter my tailstock uh, to the best that I could by eye uh, and using the kind of uh, not so great gauge on the back. So you can see I've got the coaxial indicator mounted in a collet and the probe is indicating the bore in my tailstock. Now we can turn the lathe on and Let's see how good we did. Chances are it's not going to be very good. Right there. So you can see the needle moving quite a bit. So now what we're going to do is just simply adjust the screws on the tailstock to bring that back to as close to zero. See that screw did nothing. So it's the one in the back I need the monkey with. It's not the one either. It was the one in the front. Now, the more intelligent way to do this would be to look where the probe is when we reach a maximum and figure out from that which way to screw, which screw I need to turn. But it's easier just trial and error. Well, there. See now we're decreasing the. And the goal is to get it at a minimum. All right, that seems to be about as good as we're going to get it. And the reason being is of course it's not perfect in the vertical direction but there's not really much we can do about that without scraping the ways or doing other more painful things to time effort and of course the wallet now let me monkey with this a little bit more off uh, off camera and uh, I'll come back when I've got it as good as I think I can get it. Alright, we're back again and you can see that that's about as good as it's going to get. So any remaining deflection that's there is the offset in the vertical direction uh, on my particular lathe. Which, uh, you know, according to this, which is really measuring angle, uh, not thousandths of an inch, uh, it's reading about five tenths uh, misalignment, which I think is pretty good for an import lathe. So uh, that's my method of realigning my tailstock with my headstock. You know, of course, there's other ways of doing it: cutting a test rod and measuring diameters. But you know, here I think I spent maybe one or two minutes of setup time and, uh, and maybe another one or two minutes to, uh, to get it realigned. So uh, time-wise, the coaxial indicator uh, really pays off. Have a good day, everyone.